What's up guys, uh, Georgia is here. So today we will make some 3D scene looks like this. Um, this is looks like some interior design, but I mean, this is looks like some abstract thing that we want to make it, but here we are. Uh, let's get make something looks like this. And by the way, thank you so much for you guys who already joined to be my patron. And if you want to join, you can click link down below. And also I will put some free um some free pace for a uh, flower and so on and if you're interested to be uh joined to be my patron you can click link down below and before continue to this tutorial video feel free to subscribe and if you like it just click like button and now let's get moving into the tutorial video all right so guys now here we are um First thing first, I'm gonna try to delete this uh, light. I will keep it this camera here, just hiding. All right now, let's get try to take it, um, this uh, cube a little bit small. And now let's get try to grab it here into this line and take it more wider, right? And just grab it here. We can try something like that. All right, now let's get click tab, add something uh, like loop cuts in the middle, like that. All right, we have it now. And now let's get choose this one and grab it into the, sorry. Uh, you don't need to grab it, just try to um, move it here, right? Just try make it a little bit more um, longer than the first one. So now we can choose this one by clicking E and just, I think something like this will be okay. Now let's get at the um, this side more a uh, little bit wide, something like that. All right. So if you already save your file, let's get bring uh, let's get back here. And now I'm gonna try to add some a uh, loop cuts in every uh, side, so you can see how it was. I will try to do it like this. All right. But yeah, you can also you can uh, using some a plan. But here I will just using some loop cuts for make it a little bit fast. All right. So now just try um, to choose this every um, loop cuts in the side. So try after that we can using click E and just grab it up. So it will be looks like this. This is looks cool and. This is very sharp, uh, sharp, so we can be using a bevel for make it a little bit more cool. Right here, just a bevel try to using like 0 0.01. And here for the segment, we can try to grab it up more into 70. All right, here we are. Let's get try to take it the camera back. And I need some new area option. So if you already do that, let's get move into the, ca uh, into the camera. And um, after that, I want to make it the camera looks uh, close 100 and oh, sorry, 140 can be okay. So we can try to take it the camera back here. All right. So now I think I'm gonna try to uh, grab it this. All right, so I will put the camera, grab it up a little bit here. And just for the focal length, I will try to make sure just a little bit uh, far away, right? Like this. Don't forget to save your file and I'm gonna try to grab, uh, sorry, I'm gonna try to add more uh, loop cuts here. I think we can see, all right, something like this. And we can try to put the um, more here. All right, but I think it can be too much if we put that. So just here, we can see how it was. 
Um, not really. Something like that was okay. So now we can try to grab it up here and just see if it uh, in the same same age like uh, the loop cuts. So it can be like that, guys. It really looks easy to make it. So now we can add some a more interesting, which is we can add like some uh, wood, but I will using some cylinder here and just set it smooth. All right, so now we can put the um, object for the wood here, exactly here. We can try and make it uh, more longer than before. All right, we can do it something like that. If you are ready to do this, let's get move into the array and make it zero for the X side. And for the Y side, just try to using like 3000 Right, so it can be in minus using minus 5000. So we can try to add more, but this is uh, kind of too much, I think. We can try to grab it down, uh, grab it down a little bit. All right, so it can be like that. And now we have uh, something like eight, like that for this. And now let's go add some cube. We can put uh, some cube here in this side. All right, that's cool. And now just grab it this into that into that side. All right, let's get uh, take it down. Go into the uh, bevel using more segment and just for the man 0 0.01. All right, and after that just um, try to a try to make sure that you are having more space here because it can be have a lot of things that we want to add it here add into this scene all right first of all um here we are i think here i'm gonna try to add some a chair and here it can be some window how it was it's very easy uh, let's go add some cylinder in here for the cylinder i want to using more like um like 70 it can be uh, it can be too much but i want to make sure that this one it's like you know like more uh smooth and so on all right so now let's get move it into the right side exactly like that if you've seen something like this and add modifier just boolean all right and after that just apply and we can see if it's working or not. Uh, but I think this is a kind of looks so big and I don't want to have a big something like that. And we can try to grab it up a little bit like this. All right, so let's get choose again. All right, something like this was was better. And I'm gonna try to make it more a uh, little bit thickness. And here for the um, uh, for the a window that we want to use it. So just choose this one again and go into the boolean. Once again, apply. All right. Now let's go in. Uh, make this thickness a little bit not so much. And here let's go add some bevel. All right, if you are ready to do that, let's get um, take it, bring back just like 0 .0, 0 0.05. So here we are and um, just block on this side. All right, if you are ready to do this, duplicate, control P. And now we can um, grab it this one into the app. So now here we are, we have uh, some a ceiling also uh, but I want to add more uh, solidify for the thickness here so we can see all right oops what is that oh wow I'm gonna try to delete that one for sure so click tab and we can try to oops we can try to delete this phrases and how to fix it this 
uh, it's very easy. You can go into this side and click this side, click F. So it's done. And now I'm gonna try to put it here. And for this bevel, I will not using some bevel and just apply. Now we have uh, some some ceiling also. And now we can go into the um, render engine. I will using a uh, GPU and cycles. So here we are just using like 500 will be okay and will be cool and will be cool. So now we can go into the um, world. I will using some SDRI. And here we are, we have uh, some something looks interesting that I'm gonna show you. But this is will be looks, looks, looks very, very dark. And I'm gonna try to fix it first. And here we are, I'm gonna add some a like you know glass glass material for this object. Just try to grab it up metallic down uh grease up a little bit, take it down a roughness, something like that, and grab it transmission. If you see it will be looks like that and alpha. So you can see this is will be working like that. This is looks cool. But I think this subject it's kind of blocked to this one, kind of too much, but we can try to fix it. Something like that was okay. So now let's get bring back the ceiling how it was. Oh my god, this is looks beautiful, right? So now we can add some uh, more strength here for the world. We can using like 3000 and it can be more bright. And let's go back into the scene and if you see the film here we can increase for the exposure into 2.0 or just 2. Point. All right, it can be like that. This is more cool. And now go into the color management and we can add some very high contrast. Will be looks better. So it will be looks like this. So guys, here we are. Now I will add some a uh, steps and we can try to um make it a little bit bigger and we can try here in this side. Let's go um, using some just like single H and go into the bevel or you can using control B and you can be looks like that. All right, go into the custom. If you see, this is steps. Now just try to grab it more or increase more here. All right, it's, it's cool. And we can move it here for sure and we have to see where is it where is the um the floor all right we found the floor now and let's get put these um steps in the middle it's something like that all right so guys i already have the um file for the armchair here i got it from the uh gg trader and so you can have it also there or i will put a link down below for you guys make sure that easy for downloading and i'm gonna try to put something like like this will be here so we can see this this is um our uh object that we already made and here we are i want to move it the camera a little bit into this side something like that i guess will be better just try to take it down the camera now we can try to grab it up let's see how it was i want to grab it more and for the ceiling something like that right now let's get bring back here and now this is looks cool looks cool than before and something that i want to add is just some plan will be put here so for the plane i will using from a for the plan I will using from uh, Blender Kit. Here we are. We can try to using like just writing a uh, plan here. All right, I think I will use this one. So we can put here. All right, now we can see this is uh, the plan that we will use it here. Wow. I'm sorry, guys. I just grabbed it too much. So we have it something like that. This kind of looks big. Also, guys, this is looks cool. We can take it back the um the ceiling so will be looks like that and just render region so will be looks like this how cool is it is it very very cool but here 
I want to try to add some a tree outside. So let's get add some tree. Just grab it here and we can search uh, for the tree. All right. Now we can see which one um, it's better for this one. I just want to using uh, some simple uh, tree, maybe this one. All right, we can put here and just wait a few, uh, just wait for a few seconds. Uh, we can see the, the tree here. All right. It's kind of looks better, but I think this is uh, kind of too much for the light. So we can try to take it down for the light a little bit like that. All right, now we can see about that one and go back into the Alva and just try to break, uh, take it down. All right, so guys, now I'm going to try to add some a uh, material for this, um, all of this object here. First of all, that I'm going to do is just like some basic color and for all this color. So we have some already uh, material here. So here we are. I'm going to add some color for all this object here. And um, I will using just simple color, which is this one. And will be looks like some charm. So we can try to grab it down for the roughness, like for make it more, uh, you know, like some shining like that from this um, shadow and just try to take it up metallic a little bit like that. And we have uh, something looks interesting now here. And for this uh, corner here, I'm going to try to add some uh, wood. And um, just try uh, something looks better, but I already have some favorite one that I always using, which is this one uh, made by Share Texture. This is really amazing. I really love this uh, texture so much, by the way. And here we are. Just go into this icon plus, assign, and just wait. Let's go back here. And I'm going to try to using just like this one for the floor was more cool. All right. Now we can see from the up here and go into this um, viewport settings. Just wait a few seconds for uh, rendering. And now here we are. This is, doesn't uh, look cool. So let's go. Um, unwrap this one this is, doesn't look cool it's so big go into the uv editing we have to choose on this one and now we can see from the up here right from the top and just try to grab it like that all right if it's something like this it was okay for you or looks better we can try more try more something like that all right that's cool so now here we are and Let's go back into the layout and yeah, uh, something that I forget, just try to um, make it this more better. All right. So guys, uh, tutorial for today, it's done. It's really easy to make it. And if you want to have file exactly like this, you can join the with my Patreon link on description. And also I will put in this uh, file on Gumroad and by the way, I have some uh, free material for you guys who already joined to be my patron for the um, pace and so on. You can join, click link down below. Uh, Georgia is here. See you in the next video.